Hi, in this video we're going to be talking about the Immersive Reader feature in Microsoft Office programs. And so what that does is it kind of, uh, you can let, have it read out loud to you and then change some other configuration options on how everything is displayed to kind of help you follow along and that kind of thing. It's different from the read aloud feature, which you might have used in Office, which I'll show you too so you can see the difference. So the Immersive Reader is available for programs such as Word, uh, OneNote, Outlook, and even in Microsoft Edge if you want to try it there as well. So I have this uh, Word document here on Lake Tahoe, and if I go to the Review tab, I could do the basic read aloud. Lake Tahoe is the stunning jewel of the Sierra, with its vibrant and famous green to blue hues. And, and you can see that just reads to you, and you have a couple settings here to change the speed and the voice if you have any installed. But if I were to go to the View tab, then click on Immersive Reader, I have the read aloud option plus all these too. Uh, syllables, you'll find, doesn't work every time, but what it will do is it'll break down your words into syllables with dashes, so you can kind of see the word structure. Um, this I just copied from a web page, so it doesn't like the formatting, I don't think. Uh, the text spacing, you could, you know, spread it apart if you want, if that helps you read it better. Page color, if you want to change the background to help you see the text better, you could do that. Column width, you could do that as well, just to kind of help you read better. The focus line option, so this is comes into play when you're doing the read aloud, so it'll follow along as the voice is going. So let me show you here. Lake Tahoe is the stunning jewel of the Sierra, with its vibrant so and famous green to blue hues and iconic granite boulders. Lake Tahoe straddles the California Nevada border, sits at 6,225 feet and above sea level and is surrounded. So that's the kind of basic gist on that. And then I have it open in Outlook as well too. So you get the same options and then you could just have it, you know, read your email. Go to your well. OneDrive view in browser. Welcome to your OneDrive. One so you see it works the same way in Outlook as it does in Word. So like I said, it's a little more advanced than just the read aloud if you have trouble seeing or if you want to be able to kind of follow along as it's reading to you rather than trying, you know, see where it's going when you just use the read aloud feature by itself. So once again, it's in the uh, view tab in, in a Word and then just immersive reader. And then you could uh, play with your settings there and try it out. All right. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe.